They can make you cough! Bill Nye the Science Guy! Bill Nye the Science Guy! God! No! God, please, no! 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 Bill Nye the Science Guy! Bro Cooties! God. There's probably some on you right now! No! You realize that you and I are covered with cooties! Especially our hands. See, germs are cooties! They're on everything. Like they're all over these buttons. Ugh. So your body has a butt to fight them. You'd need a microscope. But take a look at this. This is our model button of science. <laughs> 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 All day, all the time. It's happening inside of you right now. The Navy! At ease, sailor. Sit down. I'm here to tell you about your worst enemy. It sneaks into your territory without you even knowing violently and ruthlessly invading and destroying. It's up to you to stop them, sailor, but you won't need a gun. You've got to kill germs. Germs. And that's your weapon. But your cut needs you to wash your hands before you eat. And another thing, sailor. Stop picking your numbers. Oh, no. Zit. Great. I'm going out. Maybe I should just pop it. Nah. Eh, uh, what the heck? Pop it? A zit's just your body's way of telling you that you've got bacteria growing in your skin. And all day, all the time. It's usually a button. Pretty harmless. Pop it. So remember, pop your pimples. Richie, are you touching your button? Don't you know that's a way to spread germs? I'm your mother. Yeah, it's cold in here, all right. Yeah, but being cold doesn't give you a button. You get sick from cooties. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. Hey! Most colds are caused by. The time you get a cold. Your button makes antibodies. <laughs> so you can never get the same button twice. Hundred different button viruses that can give you what we call a cold. Like when a virus gets inside you and it infects you, and it makes new viruses. It gets inside you and it infects you, and it makes new viruses. Virus gets inside you and it infects you, and it makes new viruses. Well, sometimes those viruses change a little bit. You can keep getting a cold through your whole life. A few <gasps> moments later. <gasps> Pickles, jellies, and canned fruit. Germs that can make you sick. Do not, I repeat, do not attempt this demonstration at home. <gasps> what you have just seen was carried out by trained butler professionals. Oh, you got a plan to take a shower or something. Jeez! Thank you. You may not notice it, but you touch your button a lot during the day. And when you do, it's an opportunity for hands. If you get cooties on your hands, and then put your hands in your eyes. So it's important to touch your button. So when you touch button, maybe by accident. <laughs> please, please, please. <gasps> now the type of germ that gives you cooties is usually a button virus. So if these balloons are as big as cooties in our body, the enemy viruses initiate the attack by attaching to the cell membrane, causing cell surface alteration. Hear that? The button virus is making copies of itself. Eventually, it bursts open. And that's when you pop your pimples. But once in a while, when a pimple is reproducing, it doesn't make an exact copy. Like this pimple, it is a slightly different color and has a slightly different pattern on it. So then the button for the original virus doesn't recognize it and it goes right past it, just lets it go. Now this, this war, this battle that's been going on between us and button viruses has been going on since time began.